I'm going to try this setup and see how it goes. Hopefully I won't get in the way too much. Hi, um, I'm Barb. Welcome to my craft studio. I'm going to try to put together a Valentine's chair tray. I'll get more stuff off to the side and I know I have more than enough right on my table. to put out mainly on the table my kind of postal themed stuff. I like to cover these trays with the doilies that I make. I just make those with my Cricut. I just think it looks better to have something there than just that shiny surface. So that's, and then I don't feel like I have to fill every last inch. I do want to work my lights in. I'm just not sure how. I'm gonna turn them on. I debated should I go like around here. I don't know how well that'll work. I guess if you made sure it went around in the back. Try it. Caught on the little girl's head. I need to buy more different strands of lights because I know they make them um, like for Valentine's. There's one out there, but it's hard. But I definitely want the type that have the timer. I don't like the Dollar Tree lights because they don't have a timer. And I find they don't last quite as long. I'd rather spend a little bit more on them and get more usage out of them. But instead of ending up in the landfill, which they're probably not even supposed to go there. but. I think I should have started at the bottom. I think I will redo that. And the main reason I think I should have started at the bottom was there's more room to hide the little battery pack. Actually, I think it's part of that cord. And that's what I did last time was I just kind of snaked it underneath the um, doily, but I thought, I you know I got this thought, well maybe I could have kind of went around here and it would have added more light into the tray, but I don't know, we'll see how it works. I know it's going to kind of have to have that go up what will be back side so that you don't, I mean you'll see it in the going up the back, but that's not actually too bad because it kind of lays flat on the underside of the tray. And go there again and do that again. I was thinking I might try to see if this will work, but now it's all caught up on each other on itself. I know I have one more strand of these lights that I bought at Target before Christmas, but they're multicolored, so I didn't really want to use those ones for. I wish I wish I'd looked before. Um, I think when I checked when they put them on clearance, they were already gone. I wish I'd thought to pick up a few more strands while they were still in stock. <laughs> Up a little bit so I could kind of because if I 
kind of put it under the edge in a few spots. It will stay in place. It's another good, good, good use for the doily. It's to hold my lights in place. As I'm trying to get all the tangles out, it's coming undone. Thought I had all the tangles out once already and it got tangled back up. <laughs> I've always wondered how cords that are plugged in places do that. You, um, as, as you're cleaning, you're like, okay, they're all tangled up on each other. I untangled them before I plugged them back in. How can they be all wrapped around each other again? This one, you will definitely see it going down and back. And I don't think there's going to be enough to go all the way to the bottom level, but that's okay. We're just going to do the best we can. sure all of these items if I'll use them. I have this little mailbox valentine. I've got my little boy and girl bear. He looks like a little postman. He's cute. Debating whether I want to use this one on this tray or Different tray. Let me put this over here. Will he fit in here? No, he will not. He will have to go on the top. He was one I bought at Target last year, and he says post on him, so I had to get him. I also have these, but I don't know. Does enough show if I put it back there? I'm going to try it and see how it works. That's my one that says hugs and kisses, fast and free delivery that I picked up at um, Dollar Tree. Isn't it terrible that your mind just goes blank sometimes and you can't remember where you pick things up at? Or is that just me? <laughs> have these I don't know I almost think they're too big for it but I think I'm going to try it anyways it's fine I am thinking about picking up um, the little pink tree if they still have it at Dollar Tree. They may not have it anymore. I may I may have missed. The ship may have sailed on that one. Let's put it that way. Usually what I do when I have a big one like this is just kind of hang it off. Hang the little thing off the side of my um, thing that's too big. See, I definitely think that these ones are too big for the end of the um, I don't know. Should I put this one back in? To hold that in place. You wouldn't be able to see it at all if I did that. Where's the little birdie at back there? I'm kind of peeked. I was trying to get the um, light thing to go between his feet and hold it in place there. That'll work. Maybe 
maybe that would work, having them kind of peek out there. You know, this one's a little smaller. Maybe I'll do it that way. Okay, so I needed to be better about filling in. Um, I also have a strand of garland. So I could use that instead of the bead strands. Let's just be mine. Let's be mine while I might save some of the other ones for the other one. For the heart shaped one I have. Or the Santa one that I have that I'm thinking about redoing for Valentine's. Some of these things I think are just going to go on a different one. I've got these. say that's four feet. It does not look like four feet. I probably should have picked up another strand of these because I could have just stuck them on different trays. Just kind of used it as filler. I actually kind of like that. But we'll see. Um, that one says hugs. This one says love. I've also got these little metal envelopes. It might look cute behind them. But I also have the one more truck that I could put back there. But I'm not sure I want to use both trucks on one. I think this is too big. I need to unwrap it. But I've already done that and I didn't. This could just sit alongside of it, which might be what I end up doing. But I wanted to see if it would fit back here. Yeah. I'm going to leave those scissors here in case I need them again. No, it's too big. It's too tall. I thought it might be. I was thinking four might be the max. I do have, where are they? These. Now I thought about making a little garland out of these. Just stringing some, get some twine and string it and put them maybe on each level. Or just on the middle, I'm not sure, or the bottom. I will be right I'm back. back. I just had to go get some twine. Yeah, I'll pull these little plate holders. Because I figured I could use them for something like that if I want to let fit back there. And it's kind of too tall with the extra height. That ideal did not work. I have to find something to sit behind them, a little block of wood or something. I don't know, how's that look? I actually kind of don't mind it, but it needs something to sit behind it. This isn't going to stay back here, but I'm just using it as a placeholder. Yeah, that's what it needs. It's just something back there to kind of hold it up. I have a bunch of this stuff, but I think I actually got it in a um, grab bag at Michael's after Valentine's Day because I ended up with a lot of ribbon and a lot of them. Um, they call it ribbon too, but I don't call I don't call this ribbon, but they do. I guess they had to have something to classify. It's more, it's not really twine either, but it's more of the depth of twine, but it's kind of an elasticized twine, I guess. I was hoping that being that big of a needle, I wouldn't have any problem threading it, but I'm still having tr 
trouble threading it. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Let's try it this way. It's because the end keeps unraveling. or something I could poke it through with because it's just not going through far enough to I wonder if I place it like this and then you know what I'm trying to do I'm just not having any luck doing it there we go Got it. Okay. I think I could create like a little bit of a banner with this filler. That's what they that's what they called it on the packaging was filler. Because you're supposed to like put it in a vase or whatever, but I didn't want it for that purpose. through. All the other colors went through. The red one did not want to go through. That's like I wanted one of each color. Yeah, there we go. Just didn't like that one. I could do that. I don't know if they want to do that, but we'll, we'll just for now. to do it without tying a knot because my tying skills some days are not there. Sadly, I don't have another little clip to lay over here. I didn't stagger those very well. They sold command style hooks on Amazon. When I first got them, I didn't like them, but they actually work well for things like this. I like that they're nice and clear, and once you remove that red backing, you can't, it's clear there too. It's not white like some of them are. could use one more one more hook but that's the last one I have I should see if Amazon has any more of those because I could use or I could use some more anyways I went a little too I didn't get really good what if I do this kind of loop it and then just try. it definitely needs one more hook right there I will have to see about getting one of those on Amazon on or I wonder where's my piece of cart I know what I'm looking for I just can't find it there it is actually a little bigger than I'd like but it'll work it's just a little um, blue dot I'm just going to stick it in there and then run that cord through there Works in a pinch. I 
to do that over here too because this one seems like it wants to keep falling down. is right behind me so I can to reach back and grab one. And we'll do that right here. Bring it down just a little further. Yeah, right there. Because I want to put this string there to kind of hold that one into place. I don't know. I guess so. I could just do that with I could just do a glue dot, I guess, and just kind of stick them up here. Let me think. I, I think I'm going to do that. Let me just grab my whole package of glue dots. I only needed one. I wasn't going to move it over, but if I'm going to do it this way. Try to get, do a picture of it um, in place. Let's see. We'll go with right here. Pink there. stop it and then I'll be back.